Hi, this is Keith Lobo reporting live from Queensbury Station. We're here with Krupe Sharani, who's running for the London Assembly. It's a pleasure to see you. What are you doing here this morning, sir? Uh, thank you, Keith. So I I'm delighted to be selected as Labour's candidate in Brenton Harrow uh, for the London Assembly. And I grew up in the area, so actually for me personally to be able to stand in the area that I think is the greatest part of the greatest city in the world is a real honour for me. And I really want to make sure that people across Brenton Harrow are represented in City Hall. We've got such a diverse community uh, across both boroughs and what we need to make sure is that we have a candidate in place and hopefully as me as your London Assembly member we'll make sure that we represent and unite all the different communities that we have across Brenton Harrow showing a really positive campaign. So um, there's so much negativity in the press at the moment. How can you break this negativity? What positive things? There's 150 languages being spoken in this small borough and all you hear is negative things on the news. How can you make this all positive? Explain to me. Listen, the world is really a divided place at the moment and what we're seeing uh, with things like Brexit, the rise of uh, the far right uh, and even the far extreme left uh, in some sections of the community uh, across the world. Uh, it's really difficult, I think, uh, in terms of trying to give that positive message but that's what we're here to do. We're here to campaign positively uh, and we're here to make sure that we listen to people, we make sure that we reflect uh, and we make sure that we give a positive case of why people should be supporting uh, myself uh, as a candidate but why they should be involved in politics in general. What would you say to a young guy who wants to get in politics? How old are you if you don't mind me asking? You look very young. Yeah, so I'm, I'm 34, so not, not, as, uh, not as young. I was 24 when I was first elected. Okay. Uh, so I'm a councillor in Brent currently, uh, and I've had three elections uh, locally. Uh, for me, it's about making sure that everyone is represented. Uh, and one of the things that I have pledged to do uh, in Brenton Harrow is uh, when we have uh, our City Hall meetings or when we have decisions that are going through uh, locally in London uh, to make sure that young people are represented. So I have pledged to set up Brenton Harrow's first ever Young People Steering Group. Uh, and with that, we'll make sure that young people get to take their ideas directly to Central London, to City Hall. On wow, like police really? You're going to do that much for the young people? Absolutely. So uh, That's we just awesome. need to make sure that people who are not being represented at the moment have that avenue, have that choice and are able to make their voice heard. That's amazing. What a great positive image positive words. I couldn't have said it better. I don't think Mohammed Buck could have said it better. Maybe you could have, you never know. This is Keith Lobo reporting live for British Asian News.